Hey, what's going on, everybody? Remy, Tyler, and Sam here from Team Cough. And today we kind of got a little bit of a different episode for you. We've never kind of done what we're about to do today. As you can see behind us, ice is looking pretty sketch on the far west side of the lake that we're at. Um, there's some people ice fishing. But over here, yeah, open water. Open water. We've seen some fish rises. Um, we've got definitely a decent amount of water to cover. So what we're going to be doing today, we're not going to be hitting it on the banks. We're going to be getting the float tube fishing in. Uh, yeah. We might do a little bank fishing if we get a little cold and want to take a little break. But overall, it's going to be a lot of float tube fishing today. Neither of us three have ever float tube fished this uh, lake before. And definitely have never done it around this time. Hopefully that, uh, well, I'm not going to even say, well, I'm just, just hopefully we're going to get some fish. So <laughs> we're going to get the float tubes blown up and stuff. We'll be right back with you. Late. Later. <laughs> all right guys this is my little float tube i just picked up yesterday i've never float tubed before so this is gonna be fun i'm a little nervous but excited as well Woo! hope i'm doing this right <laughs> This one's starting out with the guys, HD Brown, HD Trout. Sam just said it right before I clicked the record, but it feels good to be on the open water again, even though it's February. Made it to the other side now. Um, as you can see right in front of me, I got the ice. Um, let me turn this way. You can see people ice fishing out there still. So this is definitely a new experience for me. Um, never done a float tube fishing when there's still a whole bunch of ice on the lake. We got the waders on, of course. So, nice neoprene waders, so everything feels pretty warm still. Pretty pumped about today, though. We have a pretty good feeling about today. Hopefully everything works out, but. I've seen a lot of fish rises, just. I talked to a couple of people that have been fishing here the last couple of days, so they've been doing really, really well. Throwing a wide variety of different things, catching walleye, pike, tr different kinds of trout, perch. So, hoping that we can get in on some of that action too. I've been throwing this little uh, HD Brown around for quite a bit on the whole way over here and haven't gotten anything yet. So I'm gonna give this a few more casts and I'm gonna switch it up. I think it's trout, yep, rainbow. First catch of the day, fire tiger, 1 16th ounce, paddle tail swim bait, mini swim baits, Peter's custom trout worms. You guys have seen me using these on the ice, first time testing this open water. Got the skunk out for me. Nice little bow. Yeah, nice little bow action, open water. First open water of the 2020, guys. Awesome, babe. Yeah, well, nothing crazy, but let's get him back in and let's get some more. <laughs> oh, come on, buddy. There you go. What's up, guys? We're on the team cough over here. <clears throat> Had a minor setback. I left my friend of my um, belly boat thing at my dad's house. I had to go pick it up. Using the HD trout J spec, brown trout. I'm trying to go for some pike. <laughs> Got one on, guys. Looks like a rainbow. It's a rainbow. Nice! Ah yeah! I was using the, uh, what color is it? That's, I think, one we're field tested. The orange and red. We got sent that to field test. So this is the orange and red little swim bait. We got sent this to field test, and uh, 
Shoot. It's doing a good job, Pete. Tyler just had another nip. They're starting to bite over here. Probably about 11 inches, 12 inches or so. Oh, I guess I have a little tape measure, huh? 12 inches. All right, let's let him go. Turn the little paddle tail back out there again. Another one. That's two for two. Oh, he got off. It was a rainbow though. This is nice. Getting some fish. Especially after being skunked last weekend. The Bowies. Come here. Uh, yeah, I'm not cold at all. So he took the paddle tail off that last time, or one of them did, so I just kept throwing it. Got another one. Whew, little stalker bows. Feels good though. So I'm getting hit literally out of every cast. Oh, shoot. Yeah, these paddle tails. Nice, Rob. All right, guys, I'm on. Uh, probably a rainbow. Yep. Bowie, the brown trout J spec hits. Nice. Double up. I need to get the triple up right here. Triple up. Here we go. Here we go. Got it. Nice, yep. babe. Triple up. There we go. <laughs> Triple up. The Bowies. All right, guys. Remy over there just got one. Sam over there has hers. And here's mine. Triple ups, let's go. Fire Tiger, I'd say Paddle Tail, but the Paddle Tail's gone. It's been using it without it. It's still been crushing it. Skunk is officially gone, gone, guys. All of us members got one. Now it's just time to just keep slaying. Oh, it's got tapped. Yep. Got it. All right, another Bowie. This one looks really nice. Nice colors, nice dots. Again, Fire Tiger killing it. He's on it. Got it. Oh, shh. Dude, my line tightened up. Like, I wasn't even feeling him tap it. I just saw my line tighten and move, so that's why I jerked. Got one. No, that one's a little itty bitty bow. Oh. Yeah. Oh, Remy's on. Nice. Oh. Oh, shoot. I almost had the double up, dude. On again. Yep. J Spec, HD Brown. See you, buddy. Splash. I'm just gonna start like popping it super hard and make him like go for it. I'm tired of these little taps. Yep, got it. That one feels a little bit better. It's pulling me a little. Haven't seen it yet. Oh, he came off. Shoot. That was like a 14. I just lost my hook. <laughs> so guys, I'm gonna be trying out this new pattern now. We're field testing some new patterns today. Sam's trying one, I've got this one. I'm gonna call it like a neon leech. A blurple. <laughs> oh, got a hit, yep. Jeez, they are nailing that. Got it. Yeah. Yeah. Neon leech, guys. Paddle tail. Putting in that work. Got one. Beast in it, guys. 
Oh, got one. Nice, nice, nice. Tyler's pulling one in. Super tiny, bro. Nice. Oh, he got attacked by a pike before. Something got him. Try to get his tail. Look at that, guys. Got one. Nice. Look at that, guys. Ah, oh, so nice. Pretty excited. This is super fun. Yeah, it looks like, like something else at first. Yeah, exactly. I thought it was a bass or something. Double up. Trouble up. What do I got? Oh my god, I have a rainbow on the chartreuse lipless. <laughs> so, guys, I, I switched off through it on the chartreuse craw, Storm Rashi vibe, and then I get off of there. Hoping that maybe there's a pike or some walleye creeping in the areas. I'm trying to skip this on the bottom and uh Yeah, that guy nailed it. <laughs> this guy that's kind of beat up, he has a tooth mark in him. Yeah. Oh got one guys. Oh he came off. Dang it, you guys saw a jump though, right? Hope you guys saw a jump. <laughs> Nice, runs on. So a bow. Mad guy. Be mad because you swallowed a hook. J Spec natural. I got one playing with me. Come on. Got one. Nice. Woo! Ah, nice little rainbow. You even get some without the paddle tail. So you can keep using this worm until, uh, I guess until it's shredded. So we got here is our buddy Peter and the custom trout worm. He's got this uh, watermelon, green, red flake. I don't know, a grub, the paddle tail I'm saying, I'll say it is. Micro swim bait. Micro swim bait. Got some, I don't know what it is guys, but it feels like a rainbow. Yep. It's a bowie. <sighs> rainbow guys. Peace out. Oh the guy hit pretty hard. That's in the Peter custom trout wearing watermelon paddle tail. Swim bait. Thing's sweet. Good job, Pete. <sighs> Another bow. Another bow. Yeah. Yep. Another bow. <laughs> yep. Bow here off the DT6. Got one. Oh, got one. Got it.
going. Got it. Woo, decent one. Nice. This paddle tail is killing it. They are biting these like crazy. Got one. Yeah, if we want, I bet we could catch 100 fish in like a couple hours if we wanted to. Well guys, <clears throat> it's a pretty good day. So we thought we were gonna have a big multi-species day, but either way, we had a really good quantity day. We were out here just for a few hours and we caught a whole bunch of <laughs> rainbow trout. A lot of fun time. That was Sam's first time out in the float too. Yeah, this was a lot of fun for me. I can't wait to do it out in the summer when it's warm. That's right. <laughs> Another thing we wanted to mention too, guys, is just wanted to say a big shout out to our sponsor, Pete's CustomTroutWorms.com. Field testing a couple of different patterns today, using a couple of patterns that you guys have seen before, and they work phenomenally. They the paddle today. tail was great. Yeah, some of those patterns aren't available on the site yet, but we're gonna hit them up, make sure he knows that these things are working really, really well. Make sure you guys are checking out the description. Use the Team Cough code in the description when you're ordering from there. That's 10% off your order and you will get free shipping on domestic orders, $30 or more, okay? Great soft baits, guys. We've been using them nonstop. If you guys have been watching the channel, you know that they work. We're gonna be doing a lot of this stuff this spring, especially. Um, we're gonna be hitting a couple of lakes for the pre-spawn bass, and we're of course gonna keep going for the trout. Once the ice goes off in Grand Mesa, we'll be using these too. But yeah, we got a lot of fun stuff planned for you guys in the oh, open yeah. water. We're, we weren't planning to hit the open water here in February, <laughs> right. uh, up here at uh, 6,000 feet, but you know. We saw it all opened up, so we said might as well do it. Yeah, yeah. might as well do it, and we had a blast doing it. So guys, a lot of fun, a lot of rainbow trout catches. We're gonna head home though. We got some uh, ice fishing, some hiking to do tomorrow. So until next time guys, Team Cop signing out. Okay.